a Mayan community called Tres Reyes, located in Lázaro Carnes County. Every year, October 31st and November the 1st and the 2nd, inhabitants wait for their dad's visit to celebrate them, through a ritual known as Hanal Pichén, which means dinner with souls. El Canal Pichén empieza desde la limpieza de los hogares para recibir a las ánimas, y luego se construye un altar donde ahí se rinde tributo a los difuntos, tanto niños como adultos, y de esa misma forma entendemos los niveles que pasa un, un espíritu cuando éste fallece. Cuando una persona fallece, el espíritu empieza desde el inframundo, cruzando los nueve niveles, hasta llegar a nivel supremo, al encuentro de Jumunaku, que es el dios superior. En la presencia of the Night's Queen, the Moon, people prepare delicious dishes and place offerings in their home, so they can be received by relatives already gone. Altars are the essence of these celebrations, since they become a door between life and death. A la entrada encontramos un arco. Este arco simboliza la entrada al cielo para que nuestros difuntos se sientan en casa a llegar a visitarnos. En la entrada cuelga un chuyu, que es un recipiente con alimento. Esto es para las ánimas solas, aquellas que ya no tienen familiares que se acuerden de ellos y que se les invita a comer con nuestros difuntos. Ya en el interior se levanta un altar que deberá estar ubicado siempre hacia el norte. Esto es, en el lugar donde viene el frío, el lugar de la muerte. El altar se elabora en tres niveles. El nivel inferior, que se considera que es para los niños, por eso es bajito. Ahí se ponen todos los alimentos dulces. Dulce de camote, dulce de nance, dulce de macal, dulce de cocoyol, el chocolate dulce, el pan dulce y los juguetes que los niños solían jugar. En el segundo nivel, llamado el nivel de los adultos. En este nivel se colocan todos los alimentos salados y las frutas. Está la carne de puerco y de pollo en diversas presentaciones. En el nivel superior se encuentra Jumnaku, el dios supremo. Este está representado precisamente por la cruz de Ceiba. En él se encuentran cinco jícaras de atole, de maíz, para recordar que venimos del maíz. This beautiful tradition, known as the Hanal Bichén, is typical for the southern Mexico, and for those who wish to feel a direct connection with Mayan people, there's a tour you can have first-hand experience with the messengers of death. The trip consists in sightseeing seven altars raised by families during the soul celebrations, where at the end, the tourists get to decide which one was the best. Each guest has the opportunity to be part of these traditions, one of the most memorable moments in the ceremony at the Mayan, Cenote de la Vida, where the chairman prays for the souls of the tourist loved ones. Uh, yeah, it was, um, it was really, really quite amazing. Um, sort of arrived here not really knowing what to expect exactly, um, but as soon as we kind of got here, um, it's quite clear this is quite an authentic experience. Um, lots of dogs running around, you know, children everywhere. Um, and um, yeah, it's, it's exactly what we wanted really. Um, it's just nice to get away from kind of um, the off the beaten track. Of absolutely, yeah, absolutely. Um, if you want to kind of see a little bit of the real Mexico, if you want to see a bit of Mayan culture, definitely uh, come out here and check it out. Hanal Pichan is a tradition that came from the Mexican culture seen through the Mayan civilization that remains more than ever. 